Okay, hello, and welcome to another Planet Zoo live stream. Yeah, we're going to get right into it. Um, yeah, thank all of you for coming, uh, and I hope you have a good time. Woo. Today, we're going to go in to uh, Tazzy Land. Blank there for a second. I got. I like that view there. Oh, that just looks amazing. And I'm gonna go right ahead and pause it, just because there's a, uh, we have to pause it, just because a few things. Blah blah blah. But yeah. Um. Yeah. So let's get this. Let's get this going. I'm really excited uh, for this live stream, uh, just because it's the first one of Tazzyland, right? And hopefully, it's the first of many more to come. Hopefully. Hopefully it doesn't end up like Arc Zoo Cape. Um, which, speaking of Arc Zoo Cape, you may have saw there, I did close it, sadly. Uh, I didn't have really any other use for it. Uh, we wouldn't, I don't think it was salv salvageable at that point. We just made the habitats a little big. Um, but yeah. So, uh, let's go right ahead in. Um, so what did I do? I added a few shops in. Uh, like here, just to, you know, make us a little bit more money. Uh, we did make a little bit more money, but there's a little bit of a problem with the expenses. Uh, we are actually losing money, which makes no sense. But it kind of does. Uh, I didn't realize it, but um, the lions cost $17,000 to feed. And I'm like, whoa! No, 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 no. So I quickly went ahead and changed that. Also, I hope you guys like the thumbnail. Um, uh, just looks funny. It was actually, uh, I was in here between sessions and they were fighting. Um, but then I got that picture and I was like, oh my gosh, it's so funny. Um, here he is here. I believe this is... Ayo, yep. Uh, it was five stars, 27. How long do they live? So book. Yeah, about 27 until they become elderly. Um... Something over here, Lyman, blah blah blah. But, uh, 18. Indian elephant and Gary L. That's right, I did a little bit of stuff between sessions. Um. Yeah. This is the original zoo, this is what we ended on. And this is what we have now. Um. Yeah, uh, if you may have noticed in the last two videos, they were basically just stalling, and I don't know if actually the one is uploaded, or if it is, you know, it is. Um, but yeah, uh, let's see what's in this giant thing. So there's a little bit of litter, I know. Uh, I'm trying to fix that, but right away we can see what's in here. The jaguars, which we didn't get to do, uh in the other one, so I wanted to include them here. Uh, just, uh, you know, a quick little thing. Uh, if the zoo survives and we don't go back into debt, um, or we don't lose money instead of gaining it, we will actually, um, I will, we will, um, make all of these exhibits, except for Polar Bear, because I'm not redoing Polar Bear. Polar Bear is boring. It actually is. Uh, I'll show you later. Um, but so we will be doing more than one of all of these exhibits, uh, just for that, I believe. And I tried to keep the breeding down, uh, but these guys got the best of me. Uh, where the heck are? They? There's a cub in here somewhere. Um, we'll find him. Oh, that's parents, children. Is this cool? Oh, he was right here the whole time. Yeah, I'm, I'm blind. Uh, the funny thing is, I think in like Arc Zoo Cape, uh, I was looking for the third uh, like tire cub, and it was right there the entire time. It just there was a tree in the background that was the same color as it. But uh, so I was like, I died laughing. So as you can see, their welfare isn't amazing. Uh, social space. Oh, uh, oh no. That's not good. But yeah, they don't have enough space, and we will be extending that. Aww. He's fine, why can't you climb? Oh, can the baby just not climb? Maybe that's not accessible for the baby? Hang on, hang on. Yeah, the poles aren't accessible for him, because he's a baby, I guess. I don't know. 
Um, well, we'll figure that out later. Uh, we gotta continue our tour. So, as you can see, we have another exhibit here, and that it's the Baron's Tape here. Now, they were suffering a little bit from the space as well. They really don't have enough space. I mean, we'll definitely, again, be fixing that. Uh, but I wasn't gonna, like, mo move the water line down. So, we have the Baybird's Tape here. These guys didn't breed, which is a good thing. Um... These guys, the pygmy hippos. Okay, so these might be my f one of my favorites. So we have, well, first of all, we have two animals in here, which I didn't take a good look at these guys. So we're gonna go ahead and look at the flamingos, and we're straight over the b the pygmy hippos. So these guys, again, these guys did breed. And I love these things. I don't know why I love these things so much. They are adorable. So yeah, so we had one of them, I believe. And then I believe, yes, we also have a baby flamingo. And as you can see, time did escape me. Uh, I was trying to keep it paused as much as I can. But, you know, I had to put it in play in some spots. Anyways, we also have this, another group of hippos. And these are the uh, ones from Africa. I think this is the male. Yes, it is the male. Achille. And then I believe, so we have, I believe this is Renko. No. Is it Renko? Because it could be the other one. I'm clicking on a baby hippo. No, it's Io. Right, we had, we also bred a hippo. Uh, he the must Ranko. Yeah, Ranko is here. Renako, Ranko, I don't know. Uh, is there? Uh, moving on. This is the biggest exhibit, right? And we can see here. We did give it a little bit of a hint here. Uh, that what was in here? Uh, in here. We have some Gario, which is an imitation between the two. Nothing bad is actually happening. It just that there's an imitation between the two. Uh, we have Indian rhinoceros. And then the big Indian elephant. Which, they look so cool. And we are have, going to have a few babies, which is a little bit worrisome. I did have to get rid of We do have a lot more, actually. But, because of the fact of what happened, uh, I did have to get rid of some, sadly. Uh, just put them in the trade center, just to make sure we keep the money. Okay, so next we have Bengal Tigers, which you notice they are actually in here. And that's because of the fact that I haven't moved them in, and I want to move them in, in the live stream. So, we're going to get to those guys. But first, we got to say hi to our bison. So, we have our bison here. And then, over here... We have brown or grizzly bears. And again, as I said, uh, for most of these animals, if this zoo does continue, I know I'm saying if, I do think it will. We are moving out of debt rather swiftly. Um, but if it doesn't, or um, but just in case it doesn't, I'm saying that. That's why I'm saying it. Just in case it doesn't, I think it will. We're doing fine. We have $500,000 in the uh, bank. Uh, so yeah, we have our grizzly bears, so Burhan and Imuni, Emuni, yeah, I don't know. And then the last exhibit, which you can probably tell by the size, uh, which I already said, and because I already said it, uh, we have polar bears. Others, people were complaining about the cost of them and all. And then you go here and click on them, and theirs isn't much far off. 19,000 per feed? What? What? Huh? But there's only like three in there. There's how many? What? Why did it go up? Like, I... I... No, they're okay. They're only 9,000. 9, okay, I was wondering. I didn't believe that's including every one of them. So if I were to feed all of these, uh, it would be that. And so we have three babies. I believe one of them did mature, right? Uh, sadly, one of them did, Asia, I believe it was, did mature. Maybe we'll try her out, you know. Um, I believe I have her with me. So maybe, maybe, maybe we'll trade her out. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but we kept Masamba. And then the other one. And I did install a monorail. It's not a very far distance it covers. And we're going to probably make a bigger distance. 
but just because I wanted to have something to get people from here instead of walking all the way down here so they could save some energy for this because this is a big part uh you might also it's, notice it's not very crowded at all and yes you're right it's not crowded but i think there's a reason for that when you're building a zoo right and i was thinking about this uh before the distance between the two ends right so you have one end and you have another end um and then there's a center of you know when you have like matter and stuff you have or stuff you have the center of mass and that's where it's you know the center of it is and there's blah 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 so basically you can kind of think about that here um the center of the zoo is where the most the farthest they'll the more people will congregate because they're heading over here or they're coming back so there most people are going to be in the center of the zoo however we don't have a good center here and that's Partially the reason I think why there's not many, as many people over here, because we don't have a big enough group here. Well, people are wondering, uh, how are we going to do that? Uh, I have an idea. Uh, I have a bunch of ideas. But there's something we're going to build here. And we're not going to move these guys, but it will involve, uh, I believe we're going to do apes. So apes are going to be all in here. And yes, they cost a lot to feed, I believe. I'm not uh, sure. But I do think they cost a lot to feed. Um, so do be careful with that. Um, but I think we'll, on the, I think we'll be pretty okay. I also want to make sure, no, we are not, okay, so first of all, I was like, okay, we don't have enough shops placed, right? And so I placed a bunch of shops around. Oh, uh, yeah, we completely skipped over, uh, a shop. No, I wanted to, guys, to just show you this. So this is the building that we made. Uh, using the Australia pieces, and I know that's not there, but you know, well, well, it's if it's fun. But yeah, so we use these Australia pieces uh, to create the walls, and then have this here. Now I'm gonna go. Where do you want to go next? Um, let's head. But anyways, uh, over here, right? Because we don't have any donation bins here. Or in the, or here. Why do we not? Okay, that's just, I'm mad at myself there. Because uh, these are such a cool animal, and we're not making money off of them. Like, right? Like, lions, right? You don't see, I mean, you see lions in most zoos, but, like, not every zoo has lions, right? And especially not in the franchise mode. Like, half the things I watch on YouTube, yes, I do watch other YouTubers, um, but, like, half of them, they don't even include um, lions. So... You know, that's that's one of the things um, why we have to post these here. Because uh, most planet zoos don't have planet zoos don't have them. like real life zoos. They normally do because they they are a big animal, right? They attract a lot of guests. Okay, and then the Komodo dragons are also an animal we don't have these for. And maybe maybe we'll split it in half so we can get more people over here. Uh, cause this is a bit, again, this is a big enclosure. Um, as well. So, we are definitely gonna split this probably in half. Uh, and that way, and we're gonna keep this on one side, but you can see this section here we can split off. And it'd be just as fine. Maybe we'll put in, like, another Australian animal, I don't know. Um, but yeah, uh... Ta-da, okay, so now that that's there. Okay, I want to make sure we have 